99.9% of the coaches in this industry are not on your side, okay? They're purposely trying to ex confuse you, first of all, and not help you. That's a fact, okay? Secondly, their primary goal, rather than getting you good at pickup, okay, which is my primary goal, their primary goal is to extract as much money as possible. And they're the number one enemy, trust me. They're the number one enemy to you getting better at this. Okay, you enlisting most of these coaches for help or watching their videos or, or buying their courses is gonna set you back. Okay, not just financially and a waste of your time, which is bad enough, but it's going to decrease your skill level in most cases. And if, and if you're doubting me, look at any program you've paid for and tell me in terms of results, in terms of the, the skill level of your game and the results it brought in, namely new women into your life, whether that be just for sleeping with or rotation or girlfriend, what did it do in a tangible sense to your actual results? Okay, I've, I've asked this question to thousands of guys and the answer is always not much, okay? Or actually, man, my results got worse. Oh, I wonder why, okay? Because now you're being a fucking circus clown in the club, which is exactly part of their plan because what then? You need more help, okay? And who's gonna help you? The same people that turned you into a circus clown. What's up guys, John Anthony here from John Anthony Lifestyle. Coming off a fresh new threesome last night with a hot Colombian girl. I will make a separate video about that with my chick where we detail that. This was a day game pickup that had kind of an extended fuse uh, due to the fact that she had a boyfriend at first, <clears throat> but now she is nearly single and probably going to be part of our threesome rotation. Okay, so the topic of the video today is why I hate RSD, okay, Real Social Dynamics, and pretty much 99% of the other coaches in the industry, okay? Now, I wanna be very clear. Guys think when I make roast videos or when I talk shit on these other companies that I'm just looking for views or that I'm just trying to be a hater, okay? No, let's get things very perfectly clear here. The reason why I bash most of the people in the industry, okay, isn't to be a shit starter and, and hater and cause drama and all this stuff or because I'm not relevant. Guys are like, oh, he's trying to be relevant. No, I have by far the most optimized system in the game. Okay, the most results to prove that, the, for the results of myself and the results that I consistently get clients, okay, by a landslide, no one even compares. Now, the reason why I talk all this shit on these other coaches, okay, is they're the number one enemy to your results. Okay, now let me, let me try to clarify this. Okay, let's say here's where you are at neutral. Okay, and here's expert level of game. My teachings are gonna help you get there very fast. Okay, especially the paid teachings. I wanna, I wanna be clear on YouTube. I leave a line, all my secret sauce type stuff and the very, very detailed things that really matter the most to results are never talked about in my YouTube. Even though my YouTube is arguably the most valuable dating channel by far, okay, because it's all centered around practical, no bullshit, very effective, efficient advice. Okay, guys that just watch my channel have skyrocketed the results even without the paid content, and the paid content goes way beyond. But here's where you are neutral, here's where you could be. All the other coaches in the industry are pushing you this direction, okay? They're telling you abstract concepts that don't translate into practical results. They're telling you massive amounts of information overload, okay? so that you're left perpetually confused. They're purposely confusing you. We heard, for those of you that have seen my Derek Moneyberg video, where I talk about how he ripped off a guy for 35 grand, okay? In another video I did on Spencer Cornelius' channel, Derek is instructing the people that are building his courses, okay, no one's built, Derek's not building any of his content. The people that are building his courses, he told them, this is a quote directly from the guy that was building his course, his mentorship program, which is a huge scam, okay, a full out scam, he said, Derek told him, he said, purposely overwhelm and confuse, okay? Now, the same marketer that Derek Moneyberg uses is the same marketer that Real Social Dynamics uses, okay? They're in bed together. And the same marketer that Ty Lopez uses, okay? And then Max Tornov, okay, Max Berger uses. These guys all run the same scam playbook. They're trying to overload you with information, keep you perpetually confused, and see them as the ultimate authority and ultimate figureheads to provide the solution, okay? But the solution never comes, okay? So what's happening to all you, and I've heard thousands and thousands and thousands of horror stories over 10 years. Imagine being in my position, and almost every guy that I've worked with in 10 years 
has gone down that rabbit hole of being ripped off and scammed, okay? Because every coach in the industry is running that playbook, okay? They're teaching you bad advice lots of times on purpose. There's internet marketers that have infiltrated the space and just spam tons of ads on Facebook and YouTube, okay? And, and they claim, they promise the world, claim all these results, they don't know anything about dating or pickup, okay? They're just in there to promise you the world in a flashy presentation and then you get the course and it doesn't work, okay? But it doesn't matter at that point because they already got their money. It doesn't matter to them, okay? So they can just promise the world and you're making that purchasing decision before you even see the content, okay? But what's worse, I mean, that, that's pretty terrible. What's worse to me is when you have like RSD or, you know, any of these fucking people, Natural Lifestyles, Todd V, whatever, they promise the world, okay? And they tell you they're the ultimate authority, but their stuff doesn't work. Okay, they're teaching you incorrect methods, vastly inefficient methods. Okay, things are just plain wrong. There's lots of contradictory concepts. They're pushing you in the wrong direction in most cases. Guys are taught to do weird things, to do fancy things, gamey things, gimmicky things, okay? And all this leads to a lot of frustration. Trust me, I've, I've heard everything, okay? And I, and I speak to guys almost on a daily basis about this for 10 years, so you can imagine how much fucking garbage I've seen. And it's the same story every time, okay? It's, I took this amount of RSC boot camps, I bought this amount of RSC products, my game sucks, okay? Imagine hearing that every day for 10 years, okay? It's never, ever, ever, oh, I took these RSC programs and now I've gotten really good or, or I made significant improvement. Never, okay? And all the people that will defend RSD to the bitter end, oh, why are you hating? They've done so much good. No, they haven't, okay? Telling you to take action <clears throat> is not some good public service, okay? That's like their main mantra. Just go out and take action. The problem is when you take lots of action in the wrong way, I made a whole video about this. When you take lots of action in the wrong way, it's actually going to be detrimental. It's going to reinforce bad behaviors. It's going to leave you confused, frustrated, uh, you know, desperate, lonely, etc., overwhelmed, okay? They have deluded you guys into thinking that just simply massive amounts of action over time, okay, and, and more specifically, including their trainings, is going to level you up. Like there's going to be some correlation to the amount of action you take, okay? I can tell you this for a fact, lots of guys that come on my course have taken action for 10 years, five years, and in a bunch of cases hadn't, hadn't even gotten one girl, or every now and then they run into a lucky uh, close, and then they think it was like their skill or their game that led to that, when in reality, it was just, a byproduct, you know, eventually you're gonna run into a, a drunk fat six that lost your friends, okay, to be blunt. And then guys are like, look, my game is working. No, it's not. So not only are these coaches purposely misleading you, purposely confusing you, stealing your money, wasting your time, okay, wasting your effort, etc. they're pushing you in the wrong direction. The, the hardest students that I have to work with are guys that have been like, you know, really wired up in like RST trash or any other fucking coach that's pushing trash, which is almost all of them. And then the guy is like a weirdo, he's a gamey, you know, he's doing all these weird gamey things. All these are pussy repellent, okay? This is, I'm, this is coming from a guy that's banned, that last night was 1304, okay, 1304. This is coming from a guy that's seen and done everything in the game, okay, that has a real system, that has the best system, okay? And the guy's like, well, why do these other people have more subs? I'm gonna, you know, I'm gonna have to, it, it might possibly burn some bridges, but I can reveal a lot of these big sub channels lay counts, okay, with evidence proof where they told me their lay count, and lots of times it's below 100, okay, and, and, and a lot of guys say, oh, who cares, you don't need 100. It's a pretty big indicator of your skill level, okay, when your lay count is low, you're not experienced enough yet to be a coach. You don't have the skills or the, or the experience level. I had a guy <clears throat> message me on Facebook the other day, from Italy, he's like, hey man, we're in the same field, we have the same profession, but I'm like, oh yeah? What's that? He's like, oh, well, I'm a dating coach too. He's like, we should trade ideas and this and that. I go, how many girls have you been with? He goes, oh, I knew you were gonna ask that. Everyone, everyone always acts like it's such a weird question. It's not a weird question, okay? It's the only thing we have to go by in the industry is, is the, your results. And, and guys are like, oh yeah, yeah, you're the late comp guy, blah, blah, I knew. Yeah, like it's some weird thing to, to care about you know, the amount of results. We're all out here doing this game and, and learning this stuff to get more girls. But when you talk about it in, in terms of comparing yourself to other coaches or, or, or other people and how many girls they've gotten, okay, if they've tracked and they're being truthful, 
guys are like, oh, let's not bring that into the discussion as if it's not relevant at all. Okay, now he answers, oh, I've been with 42. Okay, you're not qualified to coach yet. I can do that in a good month. Oh, I think I am. What if my focus isn't on uh, getting the clients lots of lays, but uh, you know, showing them how to have a nice relationship. Okay, how many relationships have you had? Two. Okay, still not qualified. Like, and, and he's like, oh, well, uh, I'd have to disagree there. And I said, okay, if a guy's banged like two girls, is he qualified to coach? No, but I've banged more than two. So, okay, well, where do we draw the line? Okay, I don't, I don't think unless the guy's been with a few hundred girls that he's seen and done enough in this game to properly know what he's doing, okay? And by the way, I hit 100, I say this a lot, I hit 100 in June 2012, okay? That was um, almost nine years ago, okay? And or Chris Parker recently announced that he hit lane number 69. I think I did that in like 2007, okay? That like almost 14 years ago. It's like, <clears throat> and, and my game was, you know, it, it was still like good back then, but it's, it's, it's gotten much, 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 much better. Point being, okay, all these different coaches, that what I need to start doing rather than just exposing their whole scam operations, when, I, when I'm like, look, no one's getting good. Look, they're purposely just trying to extract as much money as possible. Look, their entire courses are just designed to upsell everything else. Look, their free tours are just designed to you to buy programs. Okay, instead of just telling you all that stuff about the inner workings of their business operations, which are just full built on extracting money and delivering nothing, but keeping you on the Ferris wheel for life, so you keep paying them, Rather than that, I'm going to just start doing massive technical breakdowns. I'm going to show you why Owen's game is horrible, why Todd V's game is horrible, why James Marshall from the Natural Lifestyles game is horrible. Okay, all the different coaches that all you guys respect and regard so much. Trust me, 99.9% .9 of them are trash. I can count the number of good coaches that I know in the world, okay, and I know most of the top guys, on one hand. Okay, and, and actually a couple of them don't even have YouTube or online presence. Okay, they work on my team and they're some of the best underground guys. But the whole industry is a fucking joke. Okay, trust me when I say this. You got, and, and, and why is it that 99% of the community sucks? Okay, that is why. That is why. It's because most of the coaches are wasting your time, wasting your money, almost all of them. And guys are always like, oh, isn't that convenient? Everyone else is, is scamming and ripping people off but you're not. That's right, I'm not, okay? And, I, and I've, like I've said from the beginning when I've been re reporting my count on the forums ever since I had 100 back in 2012, I have nothing to hide, okay? I'm more infield footage than anyone. I have more testimonials of incredibly good results. Guys in my eight-week mentorship program, almost all of them are crushing it. And, and the guys in the group are always like, this is really weird that everyone's getting really crazy results, okay? Virgins are losing to Virginia on week one. Guys are getting five to 10 dates for the week by week two. These are guys that didn't have many dates or no dates before, okay? Guys are getting multiple closes in a day. Guys are building rotations quickly. And everyone's like, oh my God, okay? But I, but I limit that program. I limit it to like 10 people at a time, okay? Whereas Derek and RSD, the name of the game is to fill it up as big as possible and deliver as little as possible, okay? It's been reported and verified that Derek Moneyberg on his pickup artist boot camps is not interacting with any of the clients. Who's interacting with the clients on his 40 person boot camps? 40 people, okay? Imagine there's probably not even 40 available girls in the club. It doesn't matter. The point of his programs is not to learn pickup, okay? The point of his boot camp, okay, in his mind, is to have his coaches, which are just sales guys, upsell you on more programs. If you guys pay more money to get into more programs, that's a success in his book, okay? He does not give two fucks about you getting even slightly better at pickup. I promise you that. Neither do any of these other coaches. And they all act like your friend and your ally, and you guys all worship them and kiss their ass and pay them the money, and they deliver nothing, okay? So I'm not gonna keep going on and on and on repeating the same points, but it needs to be very clear to you guys, 99.9% .9 of the coaches in this industry are not on your side, okay? They're purposely trying to ex confuse you, first of all, and not help you. That's a fact. Okay, secondly, their primary goal, rather than getting you good at pickup, okay, which is my primary goal, their primary goal is to extract as much money as possible. Okay, so all their videos, all their courses are just designed to upsell more stuff, get you bought into the brand, that they're gonna help you. But I want you to ask yourself, do the little litmus test for anyone that's paid for these courses. How much better have you gotten from those things? Okay, the guys that come out of my program, a lot of them go on to 50 to 100 a year in their first year. Okay, and it's not all about 
you know, racking up big late counts, but a lot of them are in the position to build their dream rotation very quickly in the first month or two. Okay, I can get three to four girls in rotation for most guys within a month. Okay, seven to eight within two months. It's, it's normal to build about a new girl in rotation each week. This stuff is not rocket science. I've distilled it to make it as straightforward, easy to assimilate, optimize, efficient, and effective as possible. Okay, but the reason why I will continue, why I have done, and why I will continue to put out these videos against the other coaches in the industry is because they're ripping you off, they're wasting your time, and they're the number one enemy. Trust me, they're the number one enemy to you getting better at this. Okay, you enlisting most of these coaches for help or watching their videos or, or buying their courses is gonna set you back. Okay, not just financially and a waste of your time, which is bad enough, but it's going to decrease your skill level in most cases. And if, and if you're doubting me, look at any program you've paid for and tell me in terms of results, in terms of the, the skill level of your game and the results it brought in, namely new women into your life, whether that be just for sleeping with or rotation or girlfriend, what did it do in a tangible sense to your actual results? Okay, I've, I've asked this question to thousands of guys and the answer is always not much, okay? Or actually, man, my results got worse. Oh, I wonder why, okay? Because now you're being a fucking circus clown in the club, which is exactly part of their plan, because what then? You need more help, okay? And who's gonna help you? The same people that turned you into a circus clown, okay? Hope this is starting to make sense. We're getting a lot of emails, guys are like, oh, we're waking up. This isn't meant to be like, oh, this is all conspiracy, or this is a clever marketing play on my part. Ask yourself, what, what skill increases are you getting from that stuff? I hear constantly that, that my courses get guys extremely good. I see constantly, and I have for 10 years, that my courses and, and trainings get guys extremely good. That's 100% not the case for theirs. Almost no one gets really good. And the, and the guys that are getting results, usually were getting results before, and were a natural, or they got training somewhere else, okay? Why, why, do, why do I hear a million horror stories? Why does everyone come to me after, and then I fix the problem? I'm always the guy that actually fixes the problem. Okay, I don't have guys that take my course and they're like, hey, I, I suck at pickup, I, I need four more boot camps, or I need to take all these more programs. No, because I get them good, which is what, what's supposed to, to happen. That's how it's supposed to be, okay? So I'll leave you with that. If you would actually like to get very good at this and work with me very intensively, okay, over, over eight weeks, and what I mean by that is, is I personally will, you know, ensure your optimization of your own game. Okay, I've taken mine to such an extreme level that there's not much I can do anymore to optimize it further, but I still derive a lot of satisfaction from optimizing other people's systems, okay? So if you have interest in taking that route and finally solving the problem once and for all, okay, or as all these other coaches get it handled, yeah, they don't handle shit. Okay, they, all they get handled is taking all your money and delivering nothing. But if you actually want to get advanced in a quick two months, okay, get on the call with me. There's a link in the description. 30 minute call, I'll show you exactly what I can do for you. Show you the exact customized game plan to get you from point A to B, with a very high chance of success. Okay, the most, the only guys that really don't get success through my programs are guys that don't do anything. Okay, sometimes a guy, I can see how much content they went through. Oh, I, I'm not getting the girls. Okay, you went through 1% of the content, you attended zero calls. It's not, it's not just you sign up for the mentorship and the girls start getting shipped to your door, okay? And you say, oh, okay, I'm just gonna get up off the couch and, and uh, fuck this girl now. No, you have to do the stuff that I say, but I make it as easy and straightforward as possible, okay? But free 30 minute call, link in the description. I'll tell you how I can get you there as fast as possible. And I look forward to speaking with some of you guys soon. Okay, as always, if you found value in this video, please like, comment, share, subscribe, and I will see you guys in the next video. I'm John Anthony. I'm going to keep fighting the good fight. Restore order in the community one person at a time. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care. Some do it for the income, but we do it for the outcome. Some of us are active, while others just let their mouth run. No doubt, son, this is not just about fun. We will not be outdone by these cowards who shout stuff.